And the first would you rather is, would you rather have to eat a ghost pepper before performing? Or would you rather have to drink five glasses of milk before a performance? Well, that I do drink five glasses of milk before performances. <laughs> What? No, I love I love milk. <laughs> so milk, I would say milk for sure. From those cattle we were talking about earlier, I can only assume. Okay. But the Fair. funny thing is, is the the if you drink the ghost pepper and then you drink the milk, that's how you would you know that's how you put out uh, spicy uh, is the milk. Right. Good right. Call. So Good it's call. almost like a it's a real it's almost like a psych out. <laughs> I like I those that. look more like strawberries from this from this. I'm, I'm on my <laughs> phone, but. <laughs> yeah, it, it's very possible. All right, Brian, you want to read the next one? Okay, uh, tour with the first comedian you saw live, or first comedian special you saw? First comedian special was was Eddie Murphy right there. That's that's what made me want to do stand up. Was definitely that's that special, delirious. Yes. Ooh, I mean the leather, the suit, oh, the whole the thing. Leather. I mean, come on. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Love it. Yeah, they done saltines. <laughs> <laughs> well, right. maybe that was yeah, wrong. <laughs> Would you rather? Do, 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 do. Okay, survive on a stranded island, <laughs> stranded island with Gary Busey, or be on an island with Jimmy Fallon. Now, this is I, I don't know. Well, call, I, I mean, are there? If there are no other women on the island, I'd be with Jimmy Fallon. Okay. <laughs> does that make any sense? It does. Does it have to? It I don't does, know. It does, but Gary Busey would be really fun to hang out with Gary Busey, though, too. Yeah. Talk about the universe. <laughs> oh, I'm Gary Busey. I wrote a book called Buseyisms. For example, book, B-O-O-K, Blast Ostrich Over Canada. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. I, I, no, I do like Jimmy. I like to give him a little shit, but, uh, you know, it's he's he's very ripe for being made fun of, you know. Who do you think would be like the better survivalist? Like, who would go into the ocean, pick up a fish, you know, cook it? Where I, I don't know between these two. That's a tough one, right? Um, uh, yeah, no, that's a tough one. I, I, I don't, I, I, but I would say Gary because Gary okay. looks like he's he could clonk something on the head if he needed to, you know, and he could use a friend as well. Yeah, yes. oh, okay, <laughs> all right, Brian, you want to read the next one? Okay, would you rather play to a room full of second graders or play to a room full of 85-year-old cougars? Is this also on the island? <laughs> <laughs> uh, there is a very nice comedy club on the island, but this could be wherever. No, I that's mean, Epstein's Island. Like, that's a different one. I think if, if you're doing music, it'd be more fun with the kids, but then with the, the cougars, probably, they're going to get a lot of the older impressions, so like, could probably say the cougars. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I like that. Cougars is a good choice. Good choice. Mm -hmm. Okay. Jeff, would you rather listen to Weird Al Yankovic on repeat for 24 hours or listen to Dr. Demento for 24 hours on repeat? Dr. Demento, just because you get more variety, I think. Okay. More I like variety, that. Dr. I like I'm excited for the Weird Al biopic, though. Just putting it out there. Very I love it. I love that. Weird Al. He's amazing. But uh, yeah, there's so many great stuff. So, you know, like, like, um, uh, they might be giants. I love they might be giants. They he used to play them a lot. Awesome. Yeah, it's love the it. right answer. It's your choice. All right. Yeah. We got we got two more. Okay. 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 Would you rather do a freaky Friday swap with Fred Durst or Dr. Phil? Oh uh, Fred, I know Fred a little bit. So and, and I'm just named I'm just name dropping that because his name's right there. Uh I'd say Fred. Yeah, Fred. Uh, Dr. Phil, you know, he puts on whatever he puts on. Uh, uh, if, if you want to change your life, you got to, hey, look, look. Hey, how you doing, man? <laughs> it's not very in, 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 uh, genuine, is it, when he goes, uh, how you doing, man? Yeah. <laughs> Condescending. I no. hope you're doing well. You look like you're not. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, Fr Fred Durst, I think it's a great choice. I love this new thing he's got going on. So I think I think it's a good choice. All right. Yeah. And our final one, it's a, it's a little strange one, but would would you rather be a reverse merman or a reverse centaur? <laughs> what? <laughs> a reverse 
Merman? What's a so, reverse merman? So <laughs> instead of your bottom half being a fish, it's the top half. So your top half is fish. Your bottom half is man. Same for the centaur. Your top half is a horse. Your bottom half is, is human. And you're asking me which one I'd rather be. Uh-huh. Oh, I don't know. I guess the fish one. <laughs> <laughs> can you swim? I guess. Yeah. Sw- yeah. Okay. Yeah. The fish. Fish. I'll go fish. with the fish. Okay. It's a good, it's a good choice. Great Land choice. and sea. I like it. 